Hey teachers, I just wanted to pop on and show you some new videos and tell you some tips and tricks for utilizing the membership. So right now we are in the category section of holidays and fun themes for the kindergarten club. And we're gonna go to Easter. I've been adding a lot of new videos to this Easter section this week. And we have two different versions of bunny subtraction from five and from 12. Um, this is nice because you can differentiate for different groups. Or you could use this video at the beginning of the year and then use this one later on. Even though they're in the Easter section, you can use them any time of the year. Um, I like to have them available for you anytime. So let's just go ahead and open Bunny Subtraction from 12. So you can see. This. Thinking about our learning. Oh, let's skip With this seven this. minute whiteboard video. So you can see what this video looks like. Let me find a good spot. The best is actually when they disappear. So it says 12 minus 8. When it subtracts, um, when it says minus, the minus sign does a jiggle. 8. Then we have some time to write it on our boards, which is what's happening right now. The kids have Check some it. time to solve. Equals 4. So it's a nice visual. Erase it. 12 minus 8. I like that even when they um, disappear, we still see the holes that are left to see 11 the, the hole. minus six. Um, so if you're Solve it. Were, were kind of struggling with subtraction, you could even pause the video right there to talk about how it's still like part, part whole um, with those, the, the actual holes that the bunnies went through right there. Um, so there's this video and then there's that other one that's just like it, except Check that it. one is just from five. Equals five. I also like the sound of them pop, 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 popping because you can actually count that aloud and be like one, two, three, four, five. So 11 minus one, two, three, four, five. It's just little things to reach all learners, visual, auditory, just little um, things like that. Also, popping noises are fun. It's going to get to some kids um, and just it's going to reach kids in a different way make it more engaging. So if you see one of these videos and you're like, oh my gosh, that'd be great for beginning subtraction. I wish that I had that video in September. Then you can just copy the URL up here and then paste it into your lesson plans whenever you need it. And then you'll have that video saved. So you can do that all year with any of the videos that are in the club. If you come across something at any point, that you're like, oh, that'd be great for this lesson, or oh, that would be great when we're doing bats, or that'd be great for, for whatever. Um, I love thematic teaching. So that's the way that I do things is like plug, 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 plug to make things like exactly the way that I want them. Um, so I just wanted to pop on and tell you guys some tips about that. Um, I hope that you have a great day and please let me know if you ever have any requests for skills or Erased themes it. that you'd like to see added. I love creating things just for you and your kids.